I'm having a speech impediment. Yes. And I have a sister impediment. Because she's impediment. here. Yeah, she's here right now and she's being a nuisance. Oh, my screen is lagging. <laughs> Luckily, though, it was before you played the LP. So. Usually. She, she will be cut out of it. For its most part. What the hell is that? Rawr, big tiger. A little thing on its head, so cool. I love this tiger. It is cool. This thing is a. You can't hear it, Z, but everyone in the watches the video will understand that Yurik and Dagger just talked over each other. <laughs> so it sounded really funny. Hey, Yurik, leave off casting. Understood. I'll get the kids out. I didn't even finish my sentence. <laughs> Crap. Uh, Move your feet, damn it. I'm moving my feet. It's not doing much good. Oh. That's weird. My cat's usually by my feet. He's not there. It's gonna lag a little. Damn it, see? Get your lag out of here. There now. Hold on to it. Don't be afraid. Yeah, don't be afraid of creepy eyes. That's what most people call me, crazy lady. Thanks, crazy lady! Crazy lady! Z, be more talkative. But talk loudly, because I can't actually hear you right now. Um... <laughs> okay. You know what? Um, I don't really know what we're gonna, to say. We're gonna bring up the topic. Z, who would you pay to see in a coconut bra and grass skirt? Like a hula dancer. You're the last one. Let's get you out of here. Thanks. Kids make him get I might pay you, actually. Might pay me? Mm -hmm. Spend so much you're paying me. Cause I actually did wear a coconut pot and skirt when I was a little kid. <laughs> uh, I had a little hula party when I was younger. Oh. It was a long time ago though, and I don't actually remember how old I was. Mm. Who would I pay to see? I would pay Michael Gross. Because that would just be wrong, <laughs> but amazing at the same time. Yeah. That tiger just broke the stone pillar with its face. Yurik's gonna hide behind it, because apparently that makes everything better. Yep. Hide behind a little pillar for a... Uh, hide behind a little pillar... Be uh, oh, damn it. <laughs> Gifts up. You're turning into me, stop it! <laughs> I'm just getting it. <laughs> oh, I'm having, I'm having issues. You're having it. I thought you oh. had the subscription though. Well, there was a good example of uh, how the enemies will actually uh, go after your mages and things when they're uh, counting down. Cause, oh, there you just punched Yurik. This is totally after him today, Jesus. Uh, when you're stop casting magic. magic. Characters, <laughs> Right? Well, when your magic characters are about to cast a spell, the enemies will often go after them, try and stop them so they can't, which kind of puts you in a predicament because oftentimes you're the one dying and you can't have gathering on you all the time because they're going to be like, <laughs> and you get surrounded, then you get dead. <sighs> He's got a little thingy on his hand. Did you see that? A little thingy? It's the thingy that the tiger had on his head. He has it on his hand. That's why he looks like he was wearing gloves. Cause I saw the thingy, and then he has like rings on or something, cause he's weird. Hmm. But they got the little thingy on the tiger's head. Only not as awesome looking. Huh. Interesting. Oh. Tiger can fly. Uh. That's why. Power my burps that make it fly. Propels itself by farting. Yes. Is it an ass blaster? Yes, it is an ass blaster. But we are getting okay. off topic because I said my burps that make it fly, not my farts that make it fly. Well, it'll make more sense for farts because that's propelling the opposite direction. That's pro that's shoving you forward. A burp is true. backwards. <laughs> this is true. Unless you're propelling someone else, and it would pro propel that's them forward. Unless you're propelling them backwards, technically. Unless they're standing facing them with their back to you, and then you can propel them yeah. forward. Yeah. This is true. Sorry. Let's get back on topic, though. I don't think we ever had a topic. Not really. We were talking but... about Michael Gross in a coconut bra. And some man just went really loud. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of hard to have a topic, though, when I can't hear the music. Or any sound. No. It's kind of hard to have a topic when you have ADD like me. Woo! Something 
along those lines. Zeal runs really funny. That reminds me. I was going to tell you this the other day, but I totally forgot. And then, like, a couple weeks passed, and I totally forgot to tell you. So the other day, I was at work, right? Yeah. And there was this guy walking in front of me. And for some reason, I just happened to look down a little bit, and I looked right at his butt. And I'm sitting there thinking, dude, you walk like a woman. Like, his hips were swaying when he walked. And I'm just like, what? Like, he was doing all-out sexy walk. <laughs> I'm, like, so confused. And then I turned around the corner, because I'm like, I don't want to walk behind sexy man. I am put to shame. Open Walks up. away. <laughs> Wow. Yep. I'm eating a Tampico. Tampico. <laughs> What's a Tampico? Uh, kind of like a freezer pop. Do you ever have those Otter Pops? Huh. I think so. You don't understand. It's like one of those, only it's in. different. An Otter Pop, I th isn't like one of those like covered in chocolate has ice cream in the middle. What? I don't know. Well, an otter pop is like the fruit that fruit drink, like a Kool Aid, is put in like a tube, and you stick it in the freezer. Oh, okay. I'm um okay. I haven't had one in a long time, so when I think otter, I think chocolate. I just made a funny noise. <laughs> you did. <laughs> I was trying to I was trying to get the last little bit out of this thing, but it, it and then your mouth farted. It did. Oh no no. Come on, get out of the bottom, you stupid piece of crap. Yeah. Yeah. He changed his tune. Ooh, Guess they don't I like... Oh. <laughs> I like how you're giving Serene a really manly voice. <laughs> oh, that just reminds me of one of the lines coming up. And, th and then they cut me off because Man, the subtitle went away. It's nice that they have subtitles, so at least you know what they're saying, instead of just, like, one of those ones where you can't hear it and you just start making up voices and words for them. Yeah. Oh, what a great day today! Oh, man, did you fart? I might have. I always used to do that when I was a kid, just turn it on uh, quiet and just do charades. Yeah. Could say that. Uh, uh, look, we get, uh, oh, I can't actually see. Cutscene! Cutscene! Woo! Which is totally bogus, by the way. This is a bogus cutscene, because it tricks you. Oh, really? <laughs> hey, look! We know her! Hello. <laughs> uh, the quality is so weird right now. Oh, there's a boot. I like that is boots. a boot. Like and then boots. another boot. It's like a gigantic bowl. Seriously, what is that? It's like a bowl on the ground. It's like you would eat, put your soup in there and eat it, only gigantic. Maybe is that's your plan. Does the whole world just come to this bowl and eat? The world's it's bowl. Hunger. It's we need a world. large bowl. It's the world's bowl. And they're gonna blow it up with cannons. Yeah, because they don't like mean? people. Not, they don't like solving world hunger. They want to abolish that. How dare they? Yeah. Hey, what do you know? The title. <laughs> Woo, we made it to the intro. <laughs> Which is, I just never I just now am noticing that uh it's the girl a pretty damn has long a intro. sword underneath her arm. So she looks it looks like she's being impaled, but it's she's actually just holding it like on her side with her arm there. And I never noticed that. I just thought that was something weird happening. Hmm. Interesting. Mm. Look at this, chapter three already. Woo! What did I say? These chapters are really short. The but the intro isn't. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Three chapters worth, or two chapters worth of, uh, intro. Oi! Give me the strongest booze you've got! Hey! Oh, two more of our teammates. Yay! I don't understand this one glove well, thing. How'd it go? Is he, like, trying to do a really weird Michael like Jackson or something? Maybe. They gave us more trouble than we expected. It's like a Did lady you? glove. It's like one of those the ones they wear at fancy parties. Like Got the dress and the big long smart. gloves. It's true. Only it's you very manly, very apparently. Because it, it doesn't Tomorrow have fingers on it. Rest up. Yes! Say all, I'm a few Serene, where were you? Uh, what were you sitting on? She was sitting on something and she just jumped down on an oar. this resting up? You're one to talk. I always see you strolling back in at dawn. What can I say? I enjoy going for long What can I say? I go, I enjoy going for sunrises and things. Yes. <laughs> and things. That's exactly what it is. Things. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, what are you getting into trouble over? 
I'm looking around like, what? It's telling, it tells you that you can look around, but that's what Are those banknotes all from different countries? Wow. <laughs> he sounds so unimpressed. Are those banknotes? Wow. Means will get back here. Not all of them do. Oh, wow, I wish I had some of those. I'm poor. I spent all my money on clothes. Uh, I bought NCIS on the I spent all my so. money on these clothes. <laughs> Aren't they down. nice though? No. <laughs> well, <laughs> he's, he's wearing the same shirt that the girl is, so I don't know about his clothes. Uh, flashback and sadness. He's playing really sad music. Why are we getting a call, a call from Fort Lauderdale? Hmm. I don't, I don't <laughs> <laughs> Something about Fort Lauderdale, I don't understand. We are getting a call from Fort Lauderdale right now for some odd reason. That's unusual. It is unusual. That's a first. <laughs> Who'd have thought? Yeah. Oh, hey, flashback. I like those boots. I wonder what Why they wanted. Why does everyone have really awesome boots in this game? Seriously, like, Because that's the boots. thing. I love this outfit. Look at him. He's so cute. Hey, I just want to pick kid. him up and squeeze him, because he's adorable. Look Looks here. like he has something up his on. butt, though, by the way he was walking. <laughs> he's he's so adorable, you just want to, like, squish his face and pinch his cheeks and go, Oh, you're so cute! Well, and he's wearing on. scale mail. Come with me. And then look at that. The kid has earrings. Sail had earrings when he was little. That reminds me of something. People who pierce their kids' ears when they're little, Balancing on the edge it's of always interesting, like, seeing them. That's like, there was this one little boy that came into work, and he had these really cute little earrings, and I'm like, oh, he's really cute. I'm and then some other family was staring like at him like, what? And I'm like, leave him alone. He's you. cute. I like him. He's nice. Your kid's not. Your kid's, not. <laughs> Your kid's noisy and my brat. This kid's mm. polite. <laughs> yeah. All lost a lot in the war. Uh, God, they gotta stop playing the sad music. There's Yurik in the background. I don't back. care about anything. I yeah. wonder what they wanted. <laughs> the Fort Lauderdale people. Hmm. You said something um, the day we decided to become mercenaries. I don't know. Me either. Maybe they like wanted the you, Chloe. I've never forgotten those words. Maybe it's like the people from Chicago. Call and looking for Danny. Yeah, yeah. And uh, this job Danny. Could be our break. <laughs> that was Elliot. <laughs> Count Argon and is very ambitious. Elliot picks up the phone. Rumor what? It. He's it's not Danny. Building up an army. <laughs> I don't mean to quell the Cat, you just ninjaed. If we show him what we can How? do, that could be us. He's recruiting. We'll do it. My cat just ninjaed on me. Yeah. It was scary. We will. He's got really pretty eyes. <laughs> Is that blue or purple? I. Like, mm. I can't tell. Well, but they're not showing him anymore, of course. <laughs> I know, but it was like, they looked blue, but they also looked purple, and it was like, one blue, one purple weirdness going on, like one half. And half an eye. Half an eyeball. Well, we were talking about dissecting cow eyeballs. Last episode. I hope so, anyway. Actually, it's probably a couple episodes now. I think that was the first episode, actually. This is the second episode, so last episode. No, this is technically the third, because we cut each chunk in half. We record oh. in half hour sessions everybody, just so you know, so each episode's about 15 minutes. So usually when we say at last episode, it's last recording section. Yeah. Look at Lowell's dance. What's he doing? Hey, We're gonna talk to Lowell. Lowell. Uh, up, I buddy? see. Look at him. He's like dancing. It's true. You are uh, the cha, most cha, 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 cha. <laughs> I have ever laid eyes on. We just need like some groovy uh, techno music, club music going on. Heart and heart. Yeah. I feel like a new man. Would you like to order a drink? <laughs> I just love this girl. She's so oblivious. Just like, yeah, whatever. Near you fills me with light and magic and joy. Sounds I'll like he's practiced enough. What you want to drink. Hey, I, I like the little scarf she wears around her neck. It's kind of cute. Looks like that yeah. one would be a challenge. But I like a challenge. What do you think, Zale? Do we like a challenge? Maybe. Which one? Oh, yes. <laughs> I was like, which one did we pick before? I, yeah, because I, I was just, I was tired, so I wasn't sure. <laughs> you were like, I don't know. <laughs> well, I couldn't remember which one. Um, 
Lala grew up surrounded by perverts. 